Thanks for choosing Fox 4 in your corner. I'm Warren Wright. First tonight, Fox political contributors Ann Coulter and Sean Hannity visiting Southwest Florida today, promoting her new book, Never Trust a Liberal Over Three, Especially a Republican. Coulter held a question and answer session with the audience to talk about big issues surrounding Capitol Hill. Four in your corner, Sarah Bell Soul was there asking both Coulter and Hannity what they have to say about Congressman Trey Radel and his decision not to resign from office after pleading guilty for cocaine possession last month. I'm outside Books A Million in Fort Myers where inside hundreds are listening to Ann Coulter and Sean Hannity speak and sign books. And they're talking about everything from immigration to health care, and they're even talking to me about Trey Radel. A warm Southwest Florida, welcome for Ann Coulter. Thank you. Hundreds cheering for Fox News political commentator Ann Coulter. I like that Ann is so straightforward, you know, and she's and she doesn't back down, you know. Coulter visited Southwest Florida today with fellow Fox TV host Sean Hannity. Dressed casually in jeans and sneakers, Hannity was friendly with the crowd, holding up a microphone so the audience could ask Coulter any question they wanted. Any other questions? Come on up here. Yeah. What's your name? John. But what we wanted to know, how do they feel about our congressman, Trey Radel? I only wish him and his family the very, very best. I wish him a rec speedy recovery. It probably be, would be in his best interest to get out of the public eye for a while. Um, you have somebody like Connie Mack that could probably step right in and take his place. When it comes to Radel's decision not to resign, Coulter's a little more blunt. As long as it's a solidly Republican district, I'm a little brutal. You can find somebody else, no? <laughs> Coulter says she was a little shocked when she heard the news. I know a lot of people. I have a lot of friends. None of my friends are buying cocaine. <laughs> but thinks it's in his party's best interest for Radel to bow out. Now, look, people in the district may have strong feelings. They love him. He's been good to them, blah, blah, blah. So I'm not, I'm not completely dismissing that. But from my perspective, all I want is a majority Republican House. For more information on Ann Coulter's book and other things they discussed today, just log on to fox4now.com. Sarah Bell Soul, Fox 4, in your corner.